about greater than and lesser than let's get started when we use greater than and lesser than let's learn so 2 and 4 which is bigger and which is smaller 4 is big and 2 is small so it is lesser than that so 2 is lesser than 4 so 6 and 8 A, which is big and which is small? Eight is big and six is small. So we do as six is lesser than eight. So ten and five, which is big and which is small? Yeah. So five is small and ten is big. So we use greater than. Ten is greater than five. Now zero and one, which is big and which is small? Yes. So one is big, zero is small. So we use lesser than. So zero is lesser than one. So eleven and fourteen, which is big and which is small? Students, you're right. So eleven is lesser than fourteen. Why? Because fourteen is big. And eleven is small, so it is lesser than. Now, so seventeen and twenty, which is big and which is small, students? Yes, you're absolutely right. So seventeen is lesser than twenty. So, so why is it? Why is it lesser? See, twenty is big. Seventeen is small. Now let us go here. Nineteen and sixteen, which is big and which is small? Yes. So nineteen is big and sixteen is small. So it is greater than. So nineteen is greater than sixteen. Now let's go here. Eighteen and fifteen, which is big and which is small? Yes. So eighteen. Is big. Fifteen is small. So eighteen is greater than fifteen. Which is small number? Nine or seven? Seven. Which number is small? Two or three? Three. Which number is small? Eleven or eight? Eight. Which number is small? Zero or one? Zero. Three, three is greater than two, so thirty is big. 
bigger. Now friends, let us solve this. So, how many people are there? One, two. So, they are two people. How many people are there? Yes. One, two, three, four. They are four people. So, two and four. Can you tell me the relation? Is it greater than or lesser than? So, you are absolutely correct. So, two is lesser than four. Now, let us do the circles. So, how many circles are there? One, two, three. So, they are three circles. Now, how many circles are here? One, two, three, four, five, six. So, they are six circles. So, can you tell me the relation between three and six? Is it greater than or lesser than? Excellent. So, three is lesser than six. So, let us do the triangles. So, how many triangles are there? Here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. So, they are eight triangles. Now, let us count this triangles. One, two, three, four, five. So, they are five triangles. So, can you tell me the relation between eight and five? Is it greater than or lesser than? You are right. Excellent. Fantastic. So, eight is greater than five. So, friends, let us do this tricky question. So, they are, how, how many cups are there? Here. One, two. They are two cups. So, they are two cups. How many are here? Just only one. So, one. So, what is the relation between two and one? Is it greater than or lesser than? You are right. So, two is greater than one. Now, let us count balloons. So, how many balloons are here? One, two, three, four, five. They are five balloons. Now, how many are here? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, they are six balloons. Now, what is the relationship between 5 and 6? Is it greater than or lesser than? You are right. 5 is lesser than 6. So, let us count these lollipops. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, they are 7. Now, how many lollipops are here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10. So, they are 10 lollipops. So, can you tell me the relationship between 7 and 10? Is it greater than or lesser than? Fantastic! 7 is lesser than 10. Practice well. Do greater and lesser. Practice, practice. Subscribe my channel, press the bell icon 